Today's topic, what exactly is yawning? Yawning is something found throughout the animal kingdom. The act of opening the mouth as wide as possible to suck in as much air as possible before releasing it immediately is something we are familiar with. It usually accompanies a restive pose and is supposed to trigger feelings of tiredness. However, sometimes we end up yawning even when we are not tired. And to add to that mystery, yawning seems to be quite contagious. You're bound to yawn if someone next to you does. So why do we yawn, and is it truly contagious? What is yawning? The most traditional theory about yawning is to give the brain a healthy dose of energy. As the brain gets tired, your body starts to enter a restive state. You can get some extra oxygen by yawning and give your brain and body the energy boost they need to stay active. However, while that may be the traditional explanation, it may not be the correct one. Most scientists believe that yawning is important to regulate brain temperature. This idea comes from a study that found out that people yawn less during the winters. When the brain's overactivity makes heat up, the body yawns to inhale air and bring the temperature down. Still, you do tend to yawn more when you are tired. This makes both theories probable. While experts may not be able to pinpoint exactly what makes people and animals yawn, the fact that it is so regular makes it imperative. Is yawning contagious? Yawning is considered to be one of the most contagious activities around. One yawn can make an entire room yawn in turn, whether they are tired or not. But is yawning contagious? Not really. According to experts, yawning due to someone else's yawn is a showcase of bonding and empathy. Reacting to the facial activity of the other person signifies just how close you are to them. A study found that people who rarely get triggered into a yawn had lower levels of empathy when compared to people who do. However, that doesn't make people who don't yawn sociopaths. You might just tend to yawn after seeing one if you have a closer bond with that specific person. How to control yawning. Have you found yourself yawning a bit too much? Yawning excessively and doing so after seeing another person do it can suggest that your body may be low on oxygen. One way to stop yourself from yawning excessively is to do breathing exercises. Breathing deeply through the nose can help strengthen your respiratory system and increase the amount of oxygen moving into your bloodstream. More than that, you also need to be more active. A more active body means a more stimulated mind and less tiredness, which can help decrease yawning. Also, try and keep yourself cool to stop your brain from heating up. Finally, stress, tiredness, and mental fog may also cause excessive yawning, as well as an increased intake of caffeine. In conclusion, the best way to regulate yawning is to control your lifestyle better. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.